Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. In this video, we are going to discuss about different numbers. Suppose, first of all, factor. Now, what is meant by factor? A factor of a number is an exact divisor of that number. Suppose, take 15. Take 15. This 15 is exactly divisible by 1 and 15. Next one, it is exactly divisible by 3 and 5. So 3 5s are 15. That's why this 15 is exactly divisible by 1, 3, 5, 15. That's why these all four numbers are factors of 15. So factor means a factor of a number is an exact divisor of that number. So these all are factors. Next one, multiples. A number is said to be a multiple of any of its factor. Suppose Take 2, 2. Now, what are the factors of 2? 2 into 1. So, 2 into 1 means 1 factor is 2. So, 2 into 1 means 2. So, 2 is a multiple of 2. Again, 2 into 2. 2, 2 is a 4. So, 4 is also multiple of 2. 2 into 3. So, 6. 6 is also multiple of 2. Again, 2 into 4. 4, 2 is a 8. 8 is also multiple of 2. And so on. That's why the multiple of any number means a number which is multiplying with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, so on. The obtaining numbers are called multiples of a given number. So 1 into 2, 2 into 2, 3 into 2 or so on. So any number multiplying with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, so on. The obtaining numbers. So one which numbers are called multiple of a given number. So, suppose take 5. Now, what are the multiples of 5? 5 is one of the multiple. 5 to that 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, so on. These all are multiples of 5. But in the case of multiples of 5, the itself is a least multiple. So, what is the least multiple of every number? Itself is a least multiple of every number. But the highest multiple is not defined because the multiplying with 1, 2, 3, 4, so on natural numbers now that's why the set of natural numbers are infinite set. That's why the set of multiples also infinite set. That's why so the least multiple is itself but the highest multiple is not defined. But in the case of factors, the set of factors are finite set and a countable set model. So, the 15 have how many factors? 1, 2, 3, 4. Now, which is the least factor? 1. So, 1 is the least factor of every number. And 1 is a factor of every number. Next one, what is the highest factor of given number? The itself is the highest factor of given number. Now, take suppose 9. 9, what is the least multiple of 9? 9 only. Now, what is the least factor of 9? 1. Now, what is the highest factor of 9? 9. Suppose given, write all factors of 20. Write all factors of 20 means, first of all, from 1. 1. How many 1s are 20? 20 ones. Next one, 2. How many 2s are 20? 10. Next one, 3. Not defined. 4. 4 5s are 20. So, 1 into 20, 2 into 10, 4 into 5. Now write the factors of 20. So write the factors of 20 means first of all 1, 2, 4, 5, 10 and 20. So this is a necklace method. Write the all factors of a given number. So 1, 2, 4, 5, 10, 20. These are all factors of 20. Now what are the multiples of 20? Means 20 into 1, 20. 20 into 2, 40. 20 into 3, 60. 20 into 4, 80. So on. These are our multiples of 20. But 1, 2, 4, 5, 10, 20. These are our factors of 20. Friends, now check even numbers and odd numbers. Now even number means the all multiples of 2 are called even numbers. Otherwise, odd numbers. Suppose take 4. 4 is a multiple of 2. Means 2 into 2. Now suppose take 18. Now take 18. This 18 also multiple of 2. Means 2 into 9. That's why 
4, 18, this type of numbers are called even numbers. Otherwise, odd numbers. So, even number means all multiples of 2 are called even numbers. And the numbers which are not multiple of 2 are called odd numbers. Suppose, any number in units place, either 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, then the numbers are called even numbers otherwise odd numbers suppose take one of the big number 5 3 7 8 4 9 2 now this is even number because the unit place will be 2 suppose 9 5 9 7 8 7 suppose 9 now this is odd number because the unit place is not there either 0 2 4 6 8 that's here 9 is there that's why it is a odd number friends now take integers number line, integers number line, now we have 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, we have minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 4. Now, all you know, it is even number, 4 is also even number, 6 is also even number. So here alternate numbers are even number. Similarly, the 0 also even number. Minus 2 also even number, minus 4 also even number. That's why a number which is exactly divisible by 2 are called even number. So 6 even number, 4 even number, 2 even number, 0 also even number, minus 2 even number, minus 4 even number, minus 6 even number, minus 100 also even number. So even number odd numbers low and negative numbers could have time because the set of even numbers and odd numbers derived from the set of integers. That's why 0 is even number, minus 4 even number, minus 8 even number, so 2 even number, 4 even number. So even odd number lo negative numbers ko roomta is good pet kondi. But 0 is even number. Suppose given minus 849, it is odd number because 9 is there. Suppose given minus 648, it is even number. So even numbers negative to the time. Now take sum of first and natural numbers. Sum of first and natural number means all you know 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, so on. These all are called natural numbers. Sum means plus. Take plus. So so on equal to n into n plus 1 by 2. This is a sum of first n natural numbers. So on n terms. Sorry, n numbers. So 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5. So on equal to n into n plus 1 by 2. Suppose take sum of the first n whole numbers. But all you know, whole numbers are starting from 0. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So on. So take sum. Take sum. So on. So, the sum of first n whole numbers means n into n minus 1 by 2. This is the sum of first n whole numbers, n into n minus 1 by 2. Sum of first n natural number means n into n plus 1 by 2. But friends, this proof is the n into n plus 1 by 2 proof. I have already done this video. I have done this playlist for progress and topic. I have done this proof for the topic. I have done this proof. Okay, but sum of first n natural numbers n into n plus 1 by 2, sum of first n whole numbers means n into n minus 1 by 2. Suppose given, find the sum of first 20 natural numbers. 20 natural numbers means all you know the formula n into n plus 1 by 2. Here how many natural numbers? 20. That's why I write 20 instead of n. 20 into 20 plus 1 by 2. So, 20 into 21, 20 plus 1, 21 by 2, 2 1s, 2 tens. So, 10 into 21, that is 210. That's why the sum of first 20 natural numbers will be 210. Suppose given, find the sum of first 10 whole numbers. Whole number means n into n minus 1 by 2. Now, instead of n, write 10. 10 into 10 minus 1 by 2. So 2 1s, 2 5s. So 5 into 10 minus 1, 9. 9 5s are 45. That is the sum of first 10 whole numbers. This is the sum of first 
20 natural numbers. Friends, now take sum of the first n even natural numbers. Sum of the first n even natural numbers means n into n plus 1. Here, sum of first n even natural numbers means take 2 plus 4 plus 6 plus 8 plus 1. n natural numbers will be n into n plus 1. So, e proof लो कोड़ा, मनक progressions अने playlist लो उन्नाई, कावल्टे चूसको नक्सानी. Now, sum of the first n odd natural numbers. Odd means 1, plus 3, plus 5, plus 7, plus 1 equal to n square. So, sum of first n odd natural numbers means n square. So, sum of the first n even natural number means n into n plus 1. Suppose given, Find the sum of first 5 numbers. 5 means 2 plus 4 plus 6 plus 8 plus 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That is instead of n write 5. 5 into 5 plus 1. 5 into 5 plus 1 means 6. 5, 6 is 30. That is the sum of first 5 even natural numbers. Suppose given sum of first 4 odd natural numbers. 1, 2, 3, 4. So means instead of n write 4. That's why 4 square equal to 16. Sum of first 7 odd numbers. 7 square 49. Sum of first 5 odd natural numbers. 5 square 25. So sum of odd number means n square. Sum of even numbers means n into n plus 1.